exposes wrongdoing, holds the powerful accountable, the I-Team. The I-Team continues to press for answers in our investigation, Saving Baby Liberty. Today, a judge held a hearing in Channel 4's Lindsay Gardner was at the courthouse. It's a process the law shrouds in secrecy to protect children and families. But Lindsay did get the question a key attorney in the case. Summer Boyd is a private adoption attorney who represented Shauna and Chris Hornback when they were awarded custody of Liberty Bell. That's despite the history of domestic violence between the couple and Chris having an outstanding warrant for his arrest. All along, we've been asking who knew what about his criminal history when he was awarded this baby. We have been calling and emailing Summer Boyd since November to ask these very questions. And today, we met at the courthouse. Hey, Summer, I'm Lindsay Gardner with Channel 4. We were curious why you knew about the outstanding warrant for Chris Hornback's arrest, but you didn't tell the judge. No comment. Well, why would you find that Chris and Shauna Hornback would be good parents for Liberty, given the facts that you knew, but maybe others did it? No comment. Why are you rep Do you think Liberty's even safe right now? Summer Boyd had no answers for me as she arrived at court for a hearing regarding Liberty Bell Phillips. As the I-Team has reported, Liberty was transferred to her paternal uncle and aunt, Chris and Shauna Hornback, in September. At that time, Summer Boyd was the Hornback's private adoption attorney. Boyd also became Liberty's adoption entity. That's a legal term, meaning she is responsible for carrying out Liberty's private adoption to the Hornbacks under Florida law. That is now on hold as the judge re-examines Liberty's case. Da, da, da. Liberty was ripped from her home with her maternal uncle and aunt after 10 months, a home her guardian ad litem found that she was thriving in with Ginger and Kenan Phillips and their son Colton. The focus of our I-Team reports has been how could baby Liberty be taken from a home with relatives deemed safe and loving and moved to other family with a documented history of abuse, especially an uncle with an active outstanding warrant for his arrest right here in Jacksonville. All along, we wanted to know who knew what about Chris's history. We have proven home studies that are required by the state of Florida to place children into homes only disqualify convicted felons, but they don't include criminal arrest reports in them or misdemeanor charges, something DCF is now looking to change after our I-team investigation. Meanwhile, days after Liberty was transferred to Chris Hornback's care, we know Summer Boyd filed to be his criminal defense attorney and that outstanding warrant for his arrest was then recalled. Tonight, the Hornback home, the home that's actually Shauna's parents' legal house, but where the couple now also live with their biological child, is also where Liberty remains for Christmas. After today's hearing, Attorney Boyd was not the only one keeping quiet. No one, not the attorneys and not any of the family members would talk to us. We have to only assume the judge ordered them to remain silent as the court considers Liberty's future.